Hi there, my dear viewers. This is your sexy moth king speaking again. Today, I went to the forest. And what, they, what I found there made me quite happy. This is one of the most common caterpillars you will find in the Netherlands. Every year, every spring, the forests are filled with them and you can see thousands in one day. Regardless, being common does not make them less interesting. So what are they? People who live in Europe and study moths will already know this one. They are Iranis um, defoliaria. I do not know the English common name for it, but in Dutch we call it the winter vlinder. The grote winter vlinder. And I think in English it should be called something akin to the winter moth. But these Iranis defoliaria are actually one of the most important caterpillars that we can find in our forest. And the reason they are so important is also has to do with the fact that they are so common and abundant because these caterpillars are the main source of food for many insectivorous birds in spring. You see in spring it can be somewhat hard to find insects to snack on and feed to your little baby birds. But the Iranis defoliaria is there every year in abundance. And most insectivorous birds hunt them, things like robins and um, tits. I think the blue tit, they did research, and the blue tit decides to make a nest when they can find these caterpillars. Um, they try to make the timing uh, synchronized with the time these caterpillars are common. And that's because it's their major food source. So these little guys here support a lot of forest life just by being a food source for other animals. And indeed, this is the result of like searching for 30 minutes. If I wanted, I could have collected many, many more, but you know, I'm not gonna, I don't need more than this. I don't need thousands of caterpillars, but I could have if I wanted to. Look at them eat. So yeah, just some fun fact about winter moths, Iranis defoliaria. One of the most important species of caterpillar to our forests in the Netherlands at least. Of course I cannot speak for other countries, but look at them dig in, they really love birch tree, don't they? Wow, uh, thanks for watching anyways. And just a small funny video.